disconnect, reconnect. Boom! Should have rail driver support now as well. As soon as the signal clears, drive to Morecambe where you will change direction headed to Haitian Power Station siding complex. Follow on screen instructions to bring you to your final destination of Haitian Power Station 2. NB, please obey all signals along the way. No need to tab through any signals. Good, I like that. Dislike tab profusely. So is that Google Earth in the lower left corner of the screen? It is Metgato. It is. It's actually Bing Maps. I can change it. I can put all sorts of like, open street map stuff on there as well. I've got all sorts of different ones I can put on here. But yeah, I use Bing Maps usually. Because it, produces, it provides a nice image at, all over the world at any kind of magnification. Let's get the smacky button down. The smacky button is needed. This is West Coast Main 9 over Shap, so yeah, I guess so. so you can see what's going on a bit more in the surrounding area. However, I really need to concentrate on signals. I've got no idea where the chat isn't showing, folks. It should be. I guess Twitch Alerts is um, having a blip, possibly related to how the uh, the stream thought it had ended earlier on. There you go. It's a real, it's appearing again now. Six miles to Morkham Run Around Loop.
running on the fast lines, it seems. Uh, will I be trying out Feather River Canyon when it's about? I absolutely will be. I should be running plenty of Feather River Canyon once it's out. This is Amarillo, thanks for joining. Back on the line and up to a, line, a decent line speed. Cheers, White IJ. Hope to see you again soon.
Do I have any video 125 cab rides? Yeah, many, many, many of them. Well, I bought them all for my son, all the ones he's interested in. Cheers, Fringe. A red light coming up. Oh yeah, I did buy them for camera. If I was buying them for me, I'd have actually bought different ones. <laughs> Although they were good, I enjoyed the um, London to Brighton one, that was good. Trains crossed over in front of us. Hopefully, we'll get the green now. Parcel train. There it goes. Well, that's just it, did all the other King Class stuff, be all about some of the older stuff. The stuff that I remember from when I were a lad. Any London routes, Bushy? Yeah, most of the London uh, stations are covered. King's Cross, um, St Pancras, um, Liverpool Street, Victoria, Paddington. Southwest trains through Surrey. Don't know. There's the Portsmouth direct line would be the closest thing. That Southwest trains. I don't know if they go through Surrey. I don't think so. Woking to uh, Guildford. No, Woking. We're Woking to. I can't remember where it goes to Portsmouth. Woking, Woking to Portsmouth. It's got a cab light on this one. Um, C6443. This is the updated one that comes in SHAP. So it's got the um, very, very good braking uh, physics. As well as the sound set has been completely reorganised. Woking is in Surrey. Oh, well, there you go then, Woking. I haven't a clue about that area. Bushy, there's American routes. Yep, there's lots of American routes. Green light, let's get up to the limit then. Oh, you'll be happy to know, folks, I, my DVDs of um, Titfield Thunderbolt and uh, Railway Children arrive tomorrow. So I should get my watch on over the weekend.
Jake, the KBN fan. Yes, I will be running the. Uh, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't know why that had popped up on the bottom. As soon as the DVDs arrive, I shall rip them onto Plex so that I can watch them anywhere I like. Doesn't my mouse cursor disappear? Okay, I'll fix that. Oh no, Spad City! Oh no, that's not mine. Phew, I got a green, I just gotta stop for this red. Don't forget the lady killers. Well, let me get those ones done first. Yeah, it does disappear, look. It does disappear. Blu-ray for me. I couldn't be bothered to buy the Blu-ray to be honest. Just bought the cheapest one. Because I'm tight. Hey Twarog! Welcome. Whoops. Over speed. <laughs> When's that DVD coming out? Yeah, you built this city from red lights. <laughs> Back to Grist. Hope you had a good meal. Thought you missed it. Nah, it's nowhere near two o'clock in the morning yet. <laughs> <coughs> One point five miles to Morecambe run around loop, where I think we're going to be changing directions. Changing direction. Soup. I like chicken and mushroom soup. What in it? Why are we going so slow? Bushy, the green sword is um, moderators. Move what are underlings? Farrogh's still in waiting uh, for the new DLC. Yeah, I know, I'm looking forward to that one coming out. Cheers, see you later, Chico. Tight you go, suppose one red rose and twelve stalks, sticks them in, one red rose passes off as if bought twelve roses. See, I'm not tight, I wouldn't even bother buy the roses. I'd buy a photograph, I'd take a photograph of some roses, so there you go. <laughs> Fixed distant. Literally fixed, given it's a billboard. <laughs> There's more can run around loop. See you later, train lover. So what happened with the German train crash, as I understand it, is that um, for whatever reason, I don't know what the reason is, the PZB Belize magnet system, my track system for the uh, PZB, was all turned off. And now what I think probably possibly happened is as the um, driver was coming into the station, um, he normally there is a wait there because there's a train coming off the single track. And um, what happened is that with the PZB system switched off, they um, it seems that they probably didn't have the PZB stuff on, um, so he wouldn't have realised that it was a uh, a red light. 
So th what basically I've heard is that um, there were two things that went run wrong. One, the PZB safety system was off, and two, the driver ran a, might have ran a red light. So, combination of two lightning strikes, unfortunately. Sabotage? No, I doubt it's sabotage. There's probably very, one of these things where there's probably a very good reason for it, and it was just really, really unfortunate. Obviously, more than slightly unfortunate, given that people lost their lives. But the turn off piece of P because it's annoying. <laughs> Right, we get into a walk and run around loop, then we can turn round. Switching over, and then we get to drive at 37. Right, move to the class 37 at the other end of the train and drive to Hashim Shuntnek. When arriving at Hashim Shuntnek, ensure that you drive carefully, very close to the buffer stop, to ensure you clear the points. Oh man. Right. Growler time! Flying Fifi, thank you for the follow, much appreciated. Thanks, Lord BT. What wagons? These are ballast. Ballast wagons. Shunt neck 4.2 miles. Green light, excellent. It's actually an excellent suggestion. Pegasus Leo's gaming fanatic. Um, I can't talk about Unreal Engine, I'm afraid. Keep an eye out. It's what I'm, I'm in charge of developing, so it's definitely happening.
dozen reported train crashes. Yeah, now I think about it, they're very, 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 they're very rare, aren't they? Testament to the quality of the drivers and the, everybody involved in the network. Same beggars as Leo, so I can't talk about anything that hasn't already been announced, essentially. I'm not, I, it's not for me to announce the, or tell people about things that the company hasn't told them about. Is it me or is people seem more open to railroads in Europe than in America? No. There's always um, a sort of an anti-railway sentiment. It's just not cool to be interested in railways. You know what? They don't have to like it. I'm interested in trains. You're interested in trains. Anyone that isn't can go do something else. I very rarely use trains, Bushy, actually. <laughs> I'm going to see if I can sort out a, um, a retro evening next week. And we'll run Southern Bell and um, uh, the uh, Evening Star. The old Sinclair Spectrum games. Because <laughs> why not? <laughs> Can I have an exile outside view? Nope. <laughs> well, are we taking the train to Brighton? Nope. Um, so, um, Mike Whiteley from Mesh Tools is going to be there as well on Friday and Saturday. And he's he and I are driving down together in his car on Friday and in my car on Saturday. Yeah, I think Lord BT. That's pretty much the same experience everyone's got with. Uh, you know, it's uh, like I said, railroads. It's like I know more people that like football than don't like football, unless I'm on this channel. <laughs> You're more welcome, Twarog. More help the better on the moderators. Not to keep everyone in line, they're all very good. you're all very good, but it's to uh, make sure everyone gets answers to their questions. Will I be getting something down from the loft? I don't know what you mean, GWI from the class. I don't actually have anything in my loft. Yeah, parking is very expensive. One of the reasons UK train sim stopped do I stopped doing the UK train sim stands in Brighton. The parking tripled in price. And it was already expensive. No, but it, only, it does only go up the uh, as far as New Haven, though. The, that route was only ever intended to be um, New York to New Haven. Oh, Jesus said it's been. Now I'm going to use an emulator due to work in class. Passengers to Bridgeport, train boy. Uh, possibly, yep. Yeah. 1.6 miles to the shunt, Nick.
I've got no idea the answer to your question, Pegasus DS Games. I guess it can, it, again it comes into the category of uh, if, I, if, if Dovetail haven't said something about it, then I can't say something about it. Unless there's someone out there doing those lines um, work for Workshop or other freeware sites, I'm not aware of any of that. Oh, this is the only problem with going inside the cab. Outside the cab, all of a sudden I don't get to see my, hear my AWS alarms. Uh, Bushy, yes, mods have the power to ban people. Well, I hope they never need to. It does occasionally come up. Trains at the back, but this is a top and tail configuration. Welcome back, Amtrak Master. Tarago, I followed up on my idea of an AWS. No, I haven't done anything about that. I need to get off my backside and get on with it. My backside is way too lazy. It's always starting way too early. Aren't I the head leader for this game? Um, I'm a uh, senior producer for the new train set. Short answer is, I know the answer to pretty much any question you could ever want to know about it, but I can't actually share that information because it's not my job to share that information. driven around this area before. Whose job is it to share the information? That's the, um, the sort of the retail the marketing team. That's their job. People who look after Facebook and trainsimulator.com, so Steve's part of that. Don't leave the internet, but no. <laughs> got no idea but again if um, the, all the official announcements come out on official sites they go out on train-simulator.com and on the rail simulator um, official um, Facebook page and on the official Twitter as well so just look for train simulator the official train simulator social media sites that's where you'll find all of the uh, the right information it's also the right place to ask questions as well but in general information is released uh, as and when it's uh, the right time to release it, not before. Does it have to have an Instagram account? I think they used to, but I don't know whether it's really used much. Hi boy, um, what's the day? So we're just doing, this is scenario, or it's se section number four. Uh, this is a class 47 and a 37, top of tailing a ballast train. We're almost at the end of this scenario, and then we're going to be doing BNSF uh, on the Marias Pass. I guess we're heading round that way. 
That's where I have to get uncomfortably close to buffers. Have we cleared the junction? Actually, technically we've cleared the junction, so I mean that's what we want. Back to the past 40 Chevrolet under the train, change the points ahead of you, and then drive to the train station power station. Do so that's that, I think. Yes. Switch back to the uh, 47. I'm just going to run these round Haitian Power Station to siding, and then we're uh, we're done with this journey. I think. Oh, that's interesting. Amtrak nine, uh, 109. So, what do I do for a living, Bushy? I work for Dovetail Games. Uh, I'm a senior producer, um, and I'm making the I'm in charge of making the new game. And apparently I make the tea for the DTG devs, says Dove. <laughs> Pegasus will dovetail with GDC 2016 in March. I don't know the answer to that question, uh, and I think the last two GDCs have been, but I've got no idea about this year. Imagine the headline if I derailed it. Train accident at nuclear power station. Yeah, I think Moggy's got a different account for the Down the Mine Shaft Twitch. He's probably one of the most active players on there.
Welcome to Haitian Power Station 2. The scenario ends here. The ballast bugs will now be unloaded and used in the future track works. Rob Allen, yes, I shall be streaming tomorrow. I can't talk about the new game, I'm afraid, Pegasus. <laughs> I'm desperate to, but I'm going to have to wait. Right. Uh, changing route. Right, last scenario. We're heading to America. This is part six. This is the last of six-part series.